Hi Earth Sign, welcome to my channel. We're doing your March 13. It's gonna be for the Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. There are four points. I need to drink water. Hold on. <laughs> um, we're gonna discuss the four points in our extended read. Okay, so let's see what's going on for my lovely Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Okay, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Let's see what's going on for you guys for the 13. Five of Cups. Mm. Ah, sorry. I need to fix this because it's giving a glare. Oh, sorry. New camera, new setup, guys. Just bear with me for a little bit, okay? Five of Cups. Someone just got called out. Someone is. Uh, someone basically is. How do you say this? Um, someone is. Uh, Someone got caught, you know, it's a disappointing energy because there's fight, there's conflict, emotional conflict over here. It's, it became brutal. Some people could have even uh, got physical about this energy. You know, if it's a song, let's get physical, physical, I wanna get physical, mm -hmm. Because you knew, you found out. You want to strangle this person. You found out. Normally the five of cups is the three of cups has fallen. Here, there is a battle between cups. For some, cups get even involved. Oh yeah. In a relationship right side. Four of wands. You guys got something good. And you guys also found out something that is not good. That's terrible. It's almost like receiving bad news. You receive bad news in your relationship over here. There was someone, for some, if there is no, no side piece, this is just a person who cannot let go of the past while they are with you, okay? Like, oh, I'll be with you, but they're still thinking of the past. The, whoever their ex is, whoever, whoever that they, um, you know, they used to have some connection before. And you have here the moon card, yeah, there was some secrets. Can be a Pisces energy. They, you could be connecting with someone who romanticizes someone else outside the relationship. If not, this is an emotional betrayal. May not be physical, but they long for the ex. They long for the whoever that they used to be with. They long for it. And that's what you found out. Made you unstable. Created a conflict between the two of you. You have it a justice oh, but we got we got we got the pair, sorry. The pair comes in pair. Justice card with the Queen of Wands. You lay down the law, someone can be getting divorced after finding this out. For some, there was a relationship here, wedding, for of wands, and now it's divorce, and now it's like I'm gonna be single and fabulous. Because I know now, I know myself. Uh, what's in my throat? You found out also the justice card is all about the truth, the pros and cons. Someone here is weighing down now the truth, the reality of the connection. What did you do to me? This is what you're saying. What did you do and why did you do this to me? You're waiting for their answer. You're waiting for the text message. After you have sent that message, justice card is also communicating about the truth. Because swords has to be laid down. That's the communication part. can be a Libra. You're trying to see the logic of the situation, which is difficult. You don't, you don't get the logic out of the moon card. <clears throat> you don't. There's no logic when it comes to emotional feelings. The moon is never logical. Okay? So you're hitting a dead wall over here. Don't even try to bother asking why or how and what not. Because you won't get the answer. Because... The moon is uh, the moon is a, a representation of uh, emotion, yes, feelings, yes, but also um, illusion and deception. You know, it's it's a Neptune energy, also. You know, so you won't be able to see through it, and especially the justice card. The justice card relies on facts, 
So you're asking for facts, well the other person won't be able to give that. Temperance over here can be dealing with a Sagittarian energy. They're maintaining their composure while they got called out. They're going to act like, well, you know, it, it's nothing. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, boo. Really? Don't worry about it. It's fine. See? That's what you're going to get from this person. They're trying to, to you know, temperance. They're trying to calm you down because you out of them. If it's not, again, a third party, it's anything that you guys didn't agree upon, created a conflict, and for them, they just want to ignore the conflict, okay, brush it off under the rug, things are fine, you're overreacting, this is, this, is gonna, this person is going to tell you, Yo, you're overreacting, because remember, they're putting themselves very composed and patient. They're marrying the energy, femi you know, masculine and feminine, hot and cold. They're putting things into mellow because of the moon card. <clears throat> because they can be keeping something from you. You have your seven of wands. You might travel to see a friend. You might you might go somewhere first. If not, <clears throat> this is what this is your energy. I'm sorry guys. This is your energy where if they really didn't have anybody then there is laws that is going to be um, put in now, restrictions. This is putting down a mandate now. Oh, okay, you got nobody, then fine. <clears throat> this, this, and that. This, this, and that. I'm sorry, guys. So that's a seven of wands. You're boxing the relationship. You're trying to corner the person so that you can get the truth. Ooh, you good, Earth sign. If you're this person... <laughs> You're trying to do everything and anything to make sure you squeeze out that moon. Not worth your time. Don't do that. It won't. No matter how much restriction you have, the deception was already been there, has been there for the for, from the beginning. Okay. So it's not about truth and clarity that you. It's not about clarity that you will find out. The truth, you know, clarity is not going to be given to you. What is important is just knowing what happened. There was a deception, there was a lie, that's it. Okay? So I'm going to continue this reading Earth Sign with the four points. Um, thank you very much guys for watching. It's like, as, and as I always mentioned, well, as not as always, it's only the second time I think. I do hope that the messages that the channel brings to you helps you be better or feel better. Maybe not today, but maybe tomorrow. Okay? Bye guys!